I'm Ryan. And I'm Allie. After falling in love, we decided to ride bikes across America. Collecting love advice along the way. This is Love Cycles. No No flatties, no no whammies, no no crashies. Oh, this is a great place to wake up, right next to the Mississippi River. We had all these fun bird sounds. We have less than one mile left here in Iowa. I feel like I miss all the pie and the slip and slides, and I already missed the 20-something thousand people that we've been hanging out with for the past week. It's going to be quite the transition to go from uh, Ragbri to life after Ragbri, but I think we can do it. We've done it before. We're getting closer to New York. We can start to like actually feel it. We're in the middle of the country heading further east. Oh, it's exciting. Onward to the next adventure. Hey, Allie, guess what? We're in a new state. My back hurts. My back hurts. If you look at a map, you're probably wondering why we're not just heading straight east from Davenport. That would be the fastest way to get to New York City. We are heading north toward Madison, Wisconsin, specifically Waterloo, because that is the home base for Trek bikes. And we're gonna go there and hang out with Jocelyn and the team, and uh, we're excited about going up, up north. And then from there, we're gonna stay north all the way to New York City. lush green forest here. We're definitely not in the west anymore. Allie, what do you think? Having these trees over us is very cool and calm and comforting. You can just feel their energy getting into your soul and revitalizing you. We've been on this dreamy bike path pretty much all morning, about 35-ish miles. And man, it is nice, and I think it's a preview of what's to come as we head further east. Lots of green, lots of trees, and more fireflies. As much as we miss the energy and excitement of Ragbri, we're really enjoying these quiet country roads. We got them all to ourselves. ridden past a lot of these old farmhouses with huge yards and what do we want to do on those yards? Play lawn games. Yeah, we're talking like you can have some serious games of tag, red rover, bocce ball, frisbee, croquet, oh croquet, horseshoes, I, horseshoes. I just want to like lay in that grass. It looks so comfortable. At the end of a long day, this is all we dream about right here. And look at that. A bee just landed on your finger. <laughs> you ruined our shot, man. Or you made it better. Anyway, we're excited to be eating ice cream with our new bee friend. My ice cream is patriotic. Yeah. Because we're riding across the USA. And I'm repping hard. That's right, we are. And we're in Shannon, Illinois. At the Casey's Gas Station. And uh, they're looking for a place uh, 
<laughs> to stay tonight. And they can't camp in the city park and wondered, could they throw up a tent in your backyard? <laughs> this is really cool. We've been in this park for about five minutes and the town mayor and the town pastor and we have some new friends are all helping us find a place to camp. It's amazing. I love this community already. And what, what was your name again? My name is Mike. Mike, this is Pastor Mike, and he is hooking it up. Thank you so much. How's it going? I'm Ryan. Oh, I'm sorry, Ryan. I'm Don. Nice, nice to, to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, this is a camera. Say hi. 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 We've only been here for 15 minutes, and we I, th I think we know a quarter of the town, and they're all helping us find a place to stay. Hello, yeah. how's it going? We just oh, rode great. up from Davenport today. Davenport? Yeah. So you did rag uh, Yeah, we did rag yeah. Where are you headed? We're going to New York City. Oh my gosh. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. it was so great to meet you. you Thanks for helping us out, I appreciate you. it. Alan, good yeah. to meet you. God bless you guys. Thank you, thank yep. you. See you later, buddy. Bye bye. 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 I have love advice. Being married for 34 years, love is a choice. And sometimes you don't want to choose it, but you have to choose it. You'd rather choose anger or jealousy or whatever, but you have to choose love. I like That's that. All I, I like that. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. I'm Ryan. Nice to meet you. Hi, Allie. Allie. Allie, once again, road magic in full effect. <laughs> so cool. Yeah, the people of Shannon are awesome. Yeah. It has been such a pleasure and so just, yeah, enjoyable to roll into this town and all of a sudden there's the mayors being called and the pastor and everyone else. And yeah, and it happens so fast. <laughs> happens so fast. Here we are in this beautiful backyard. With, with our new friend our Ken, new friend who Ken. did Ragbri last week, yeah. and he loves bikes, and he's raising money for, money for cancer research. And yeah, I mean, all he had to do is make one phone call. He didn't even know who we were. He's like, yeah, sure, they can camp here. He's like, actually, they can stay in the house if they want. And it's like, People are really nice. Yep, it's just a good reminder from the universe that we're in exactly the right place right now. Exactly. This is the good life. Thank you, my friend. Yeah, you're welcome. As a kid growing up, I always saw fireflies like in movies or on TV, but we did not have these things in Colorado. I didn't really think they existed until I went out east, and I still love fireflies. There's something seriously magical going on. And now to top off a perfect evening with some Casey's pizza, watching fireflies, listening to the cicadas. It was a good day, what do you think? I can't talk, I'm chewing. She can't talk because she's chewing. What she would say though, if she could talk, is it was a good day. <laughs> good morning. Good morning, man beast. How's it going? I'm good. I woke up in some kind of a magical wonderland here. And now we're gonna go to breakfast with Ken. He came out and said, hey, I'll buy you guys breakfast. So that sounds like a really good plan. This right here might be the best looking breakfast we've had on our entire trip. <laughs> some good stuff. I got some sour cherry jam. Yeah. There's also sour cherry jelly, but I chose the jam. <laughs> These two right here have been married for 48 years, right? Yeah. Long, a long time. <laughs> yeah, so tell us, um, how do, you, how do you stay happy and healthy and married and smiling every morning when you've been with the same person for 48 years? You do, yeah, you do your do own that? thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we pretty much do our own thing. We let each other do what they want to do. And uh, what's important to us is church and family. Very I think important. as long as the belief structure is there to start out with, you know, you got to trust each other. Like I said, he's riding yeah. and taking off, and I do. I'm the introvert, I stay home, and uh, it works. <laughs> yeah, it works, whatever it is we do. <laughs> the grandkids are the frosting on the cake of life. 
the second time around, it's just... Uh, we were blessed with kids. We yeah. never had, a, and those those kids never had a bitter tongue. I mean, they're a wonderful blessing in our life. Final question. Do you think he looks sexy in spandex? <laughs> he actually does look pretty good most, most of the time in his fights. So once he loses the weight from the yeah. winter weight, you know. <laughs> so I lost 15 pounds running for the U.S. Cycle Challenge. So otherwise, the grandkids think Grandpa's pregnant, <laughs> which is bad. So Ken is having a very hard time saying goodbye to us, and he said, "Why don't I just ride with you today?" So we're gonna ride together. Yeah, my inspiration, a little hula girl, and that thing was given to me by Dean Fogarty. Believe it or not, from Boulder, Colorado. This is really fun. Ken has taken us on some of his favorite bike routes that he rides every single day out here. Ken has just delivered us right to the Jane Adams Trail. Yeah. We have a new friend here in Shannon, Illinois. Thank you yeah, so much. Yeah, you do. Thank, Thank you, Ken. You. Come visit I'm us in Boulder. Come to Boulder and Come to Boulder. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Happy trails. Yeah, thank you so much. Going into the forest. Oh, wow. This Jane Adams Trail is heading us straight north into Wisconsin for about 15 miles. Then we're going to link up with the Badger State Trail. The past couple days we've been relying completely on Google Maps and using the bicycle function. And we really didn't know what we were going to hit or what we were going to see. And we've been very lucky to have found some great bike paths all the way up to Wisconsin essentially. Nice and safe away from the roads. And I don't think there's any alligators in here, so we're good to go. Hey, Allie, we're in a new state. You know what time it is. Time for a dance party. Okay, here we go. Let's go. You excited about Wisconsin? Yeah. Cheese, baby. Cheese, baby. Have you ever been to Wisconsin? <laughs> I have been to Wisconsin. I was in Milwaukee once. That's in Wisconsin, right? Yep. Okay, just making sure. <laughs> Google Maps has us on the Badger State Trail all the way into Madison. Um, this trail has been so beautiful. Um, first 15 miles, and I'm psyched to stay on it. It's shady, it's cool, great surface. There are birds chattering. What more do we want? This is what the beautiful Badger State Trail looks like. And it's surprising because it covers all the outside world. You can't see out. And this is what most of Wisconsin looks like out here. It's just farm fields and corn. And uh, we're liking it in our little tunnel of love in there.
A little slippery. Whoa. A little bumpy there. We made it! <laughs> that was fun. We're riding into Madison right now, and we're on this bike path, and these cute little boys right here are like, free lemonade! Wow, thank you so much! Can I have a high five? Yeah, yeah, that was nice. <laughs> can I give you a, a gift? So I have these really cool stickers. So you can have that, and your brother can have... Here you go. You're, you're welcome, yeah! <laughs> Yeah, you not only gave us lemonade, but you made us smile, and that's very important. High fives for lemonade. Oh yeah, yeah one more. Yeah. Bam! These little guys right here are the best free lemonade makers in all the world. What a great way to enter Madison. We're rolling into Madison, it's a beautiful evening. The bike path is full of people running and biking and all sorts of physical fitness. It reminds me of Boulder. And we are going to stay tonight and a couple other nights with the friends of Jocelyn. She's hooked us up with some nice people. We've never met them, but we're excited to make some new friends. How's it going? Like your videos. We're just like the people in the videos. How you doing? Great, great to meet you. This is so great. <laughs> Hello, everybody. So great to meet you all. <laughs> so Estelle and Don have been married 60... It'll be 60 years, August years. 6th. 60 incredible. years, yeah. The street, the secret. Do whatever she says. <laughs> it's easy. Yeah. It's I mean, it, it's, it's so easy. <laughs> no, it's not easy. It's simple, but not easy. <laughs> I love and if it. If it were true. We so we just <laughs> rolled in here, and they're having their little Tuesday afternoon cocktail party. We got to know all these wonderful people, and thank you for letting us join you. Well, it's it was just really a fun. Pleasure. I'm, I'm amazed that you're doing this. All right, here we are. This is our home in Madison. Thank you so much. You guys are the best. Yeah, this is great. Seriously. <laughs> we don't have to camp tonight because of, because of these kind people. We felt we knew you as soon as we saw you out there in the sidewalk. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to YouTube.